Hi, everybody. Quint Lear's NewHomeSales.com. We are having a great time at the 2017 Nationals, and I'm I'm very honored to have Mark Ivey and Caroline Ash. Thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, great. Thank you for having us. This is like our fifth try, and <laughs> she's a pro and uh, very generous. This is a very special award. So this is the award that they give for giving back. And now she's going to give me the award. I really appreciate this. No, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> We're going to take well, it I home. it was all about giving back, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> well, we came a long way to, to hopefully um, get this. So we are very excited to, to bring home the Builder Community Spirit Award. What, what I think is really cool about this is this is about giving back. And you keep hearing this. A lot of times people want to give in secret. And there's a part for that. But there's also provoking one another on towards love and good works. The Bible talks about that. And and here you're doing this being an ex- as an example um, and you're in a smart way to give back and to make an impact. What did it mean first to win this award? It was just a culmination of it started with a, a what I thought was a small idea and we just uh, we put the charity part of it um, together with it and it just kind of exploded. We had a great response from our trade partners. They really got behind us and um, all of the community and it just was a it was just great to see everybody kind of come come behind such a such a great effort for our community and this is an example to uh, so many other home builders and salespeople if you're going to partake of a community you need to partake in that community but you did it in a very creative way and um and you were recognized this evening for that tell me what you did different with the whole facebook thing that was fascinating yeah so we paired it with um the charity house was paired with a program called the house that facebook built so we have a design studio that we showcased as well and our designer and I created all of these design vignettes and colors and different selections that our Facebook followers could then um, vote on and what they voted on actually went in the house. So they built the house from the exterior color to the front door color to the faucet that went in the kitchen. Um, they, they chose it and could see it in the house um, in weeks, la- weeks later. What a creative way to do that. And then with this home, tell me about the whole process and who benefited from it. So we had three main charity partners, which was um, the uh, Augusta Warrior Project, the Augusta uh, Chapter of the Red Cross, and the Children's Hospital of Georgia. And they each benefited equally um, with, from, from the proceeds of the sale. And we did have um, some smaller uh, charities that, that did get some benefit as well. Total sum raised to give to these uh, worthy charities, what was it? It was um, about $80,000. That, that's unbelievable, and you had fun. You got a, po- a lot of positive exposure. You got the community involved. Um, you must be very proud. Yeah, you know, all this just shows how good Caroline is at her job. I mean, she's the one that came up with the idea of the Facebook house. We as a company had been talking for a long time about doing a charity house. It's a way for us to give back. Uh, a lot of us are involved in the community. We give of our time, but this was a way of us to give of our resources as well. And so I thank Caroline for coming up with the idea to pair that, that need or desire to do a charity house with the idea to let uh, Facebook participate and our followers. I, I think that's so creative. And people today, especially the millennials, they talk about they want to be involved and make it. They want to say, hey, look what we did. You've got people involved, very smart, a lot more fun than getting a billboard, right? Oh, yeah. We had we had so much fun with it. And people could not wait to see the next vignette, what they were going to be picking. They could not wait to see what the winning vote was. Um, and, and they could get on and vote as, as much as they want. So there was a big competition. We, you know, if, if you wanted voted, if you if you wanted vignette A, it's in it's not in the lead. So, you know, we were just trying to drive people uh, to the site and, you know, get involved with the with the uh, with the program so here's a quick question how do you pick the charities because I mean that would be like oh my gosh you got this children's hospital you got these people that must be very p- difficult how do you do that well um, one we, we all kind of collaborated on it we had a list of um, you know charities that we thought would would benefit but um, Matt Ivy our other um, co-owner his his brother is involved heavily with the Augusta um, chapter of the Red Cross he sees every day um, the impact that they have on our community we have a very um, heavy military community in the Augusta area and so um, that was just just a perfect fit uh, with the Augusta Warrior Project and then our entire region um, not even the, not just the state of Georgia um, benefits from the children ho- children's hospital that's in our area so that again was just another um, just a, an easy f- a fit for this project guys follow the example of the of Ivy residential they're doing great things what a creative idea and you know you, 
uh, also featuring your, your company and what you guys are doing in a positive light. Thank you again, and congratulations on your work. Thank you very much. Thank you. My pleasure. NewHomeSales.com with my friends here with Ivy Residential. Congratulations again. Thank you.